Hey guys, welcome back. So today we're gonna to be working on math and you are gonna need a pencil for this and then you will need two colors. So I have markers today that I'm gonna be using. Maybe mommy has one of these in her house. You can use that too. If you don't have anything, don't worry. You can just use your pencil. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. The first thing that I want you to do is I want you to draw five circles while we're talking. So what we're doing today is we are decomposing numbers, and that means that we are going to be showing different ways to make the same number. Now we have done this before in our math journals, but it's been a while, so we're gonna review. Now I have got one, two, three, four, five circles. I am gonna go back and check that. And then guess what else I'm gonna go ahead I'm going to put another row of five circles right below. Now, when you do this, you are going to use a color. And remember, I use that color until I don't want to use it anymore. Then when I lay it down, I do not pick it up again. Okay, I am not making a pattern today, so I'm not going to switch back and forth with my colors. I'm going to pick a color. I'm going to stick with it. When I am done with it, I am not going back because I do not want to make a pattern today. So I'm going to start with pink, and that means every single time I'm going to start with pink. I'm not going to switch and change back and forth and change my mind. I'm always going to start with pink. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to use pink to color in until I don't want to anymore. You know what? I like pink. So I'm going to use it for a while. Here I go. One, two, three, four. That's good, I think. Don't you? Yeah, it looks pretty good. So now I'm going to switch colors, and I'm going to use green. Okay, finish my circles. Now this time, I'm going to start with, that's right, pink. Because remember, I started with pink this time. I have to always start with pink. So I'm gonna start with pink, but I wanna do different a different way. So this time, I'm not gonna go so far, I'm gonna stop. Hmm, let's see here. I've gotta be careful, because look, if I do it again, it's gonna match. I don't wanna do that, so I'm gonna stop. And I'm gonna fill in the rest with green. And then on the next one, if you can remember, what do I start with? Anybody remember? Good job, it's pink. Remember, I always start with the same color. This time, guess what? I'm only gonna use the one. I'm just gonna do it one time, that's it. And then I'm gonna fill in the rest with green, which I can do. Now, when you do this at home, you are going to be able to do different ways, even more different ways than this. So you should go ahead and draw more rows that you can fill in by yourself. I'm just gonna give you this example. That's all I'm doing. I'm not gonna do it all for you because I want you to practice a little bit at your house. So when I look at this, these are different ways to make five. And let's see how we did that. We have one, two, three, four pinks on this one. So I'm gonna put the number four. And how many greens do I have? Good job, I've got one green. So if I add those together, what will it equal? One, two, three, four, five, that's right. Every time it's gonna equal five, because if you remember, I drew five circles. So let's see if this one's different. One, two, three, that one is different. And how many greens? One, two, so we've got two greens. And if I add those two together, it is going to equal, good job, it's gonna equal five. Because remember, I did one, two, three, four, five circles. Let's look at this one on the bottom. How many pinks do I have this time? Well, I got one. And then let's see our greens. One, two, three, four. This side, and if I add those together, it will equal Five, good job. Now there are different ways to do this. I want you to explore at home and see if you can figure out a different way to make the number five. And if you do all of the number five ones, guess what? You can challenge yourself and do 10. Number 10, that's awesome. But you're super smart. I know you can do it. I 
can't wait to talk to you guys. I miss you a lot, and I hope that you are having a lot of fun at home. Bye.